Hey everybody, it's Jason with Parallel Reality coming back with you today with an article from Not The Bee. It's the Babylon Bee's actual news site. Uh, it's dated December 18th, and I just thought this was really funny. I saw this and I was like, I gotta talk about this. So I haven't read the article itself, but the headline was enough to make me go, oh, this should be fun. It says, crime is so bad, these armed bandits had their getaway car stolen during a robbery in Colorado. So the, the bandits got, you know, taken advantage of. So... It's nice to see when it goes around, it, it comes around. You know, crime is bad when the criminals are being victimized in the middle of their crimes. Police say three masked men went to a check saving ca a check cashing service, I can read, in Commerce City, Colorado, to rob the store. While the armed men were in the act of robbing the business, someone else outside was busy robbing them. The three guys walked out of the store only to discover their getaway car had been stolen. So if you're the kind of folks who would rob a check cashing business, you probably can't be too upset when you discover that another criminal took advantage of your negligence. That's just funny. They left their, what did they leave their car out there? And somebody else is just like, yoink, I'll take that. Thank you very much. And while well, I'm sure these guys got caught, and it looks like they certainly did. So it is what John Lennon called instant karma. And that's what I was thinking. Instant karma is going to get you. Yeah. There's a common city police department posted this on their Facebook page after the robbery. And it says, in an unexpected and ironic twist, as the trio was robbing the business, a fourth criminal stole their getaway vehicle, which may have already been stolen. Jesus. We don't know. If we get a solid description of it, we will release that here. This is just amateur robbery antics, if you ask me. Everyone knows that if you've got three people in a criminal enterprise like this one, one of them has to stay behind inside the getaway car as a driver. Yeah, I mean, I know that. Jeez, I've, I've watched enough movies with that in there. Like, that seems like it's just a duh. So this, at the end, at the top of this story, people have arrested two of the three individuals who allegedly attempted the robbery, and one still managed to get away without a car. Since the stolen car was likely already stolen and police don't have a good description of the car, the thief has not been located yet either. So his life is now, or life is too crazy now for satire and then other stuff. So, so what would you guys think about this? Let's say you were, ro you were robbing a place and then someone took your car from you. Like, at least they got two of the three guys. I guess we'll hopefully find out that they got the third one. But what do you think about this stupidity, yeah, especially with, you know, crime exploding all over the country? So let me know in the comments below. It's a short one today. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.